ladies and gentlemen, let's give a warm Iowa welcome to President Joe Biden. I'm here today because homegrown biofuels have a role to play right now, right now, as we work to get, as we work to get prices under control and reduce the costs for families. Putin's invasion of Ukraine has driven up gas prices and food prices all over the world. Ukraine and Russia are not doing what they usually do, so everything's going up. We saw today's inflation data. Seventy percent of the increase in prices in March came from Putin's price hike in gasoline. We need to address this challenge with an urgency to the demands. That's why I've called on Congress to move immediately to lower the cost of families' utility bills, prescription drug bills, and more, while lowering the deficit to reduce inflationary pressures. And that's what we've done. We lowered the deficit by $300 billion so far. But even as we work with Congress, I'm not going to wait to take action to help American families. I'm doing everything within my power by executive orders to bring down the price and address the Putin price hike. I've authorized the release of 1 million barrels per day for the next six months from our Strategic Petroleum Reserve. This is by far the largest release of our national reserve in history. It's a wartime bridge to increase oil supply as we work to, with U.S. Producer, oil producers to ramp up their production this year. And we're not just learning and leaning on our reserves and our allies and partners to help bring down the gas, gas prices and to power the nation. We're leaning on you, our farmers, our biofuel refiners, Today, I'm announcing that the environmental, and I don't think as much of an announcement has already broken out pretty much the last 24 hours, but the Environmental Protection Agency is planning to issue an emergency waiver to allow E15 gasoline that uses more ethanol from homegrown crops to be sold across the United States this summer in order to increase fuel supply. E15 is about 10 cents a gallon cheaper than E10, and some gas stations offer an even bigger discount than that. But many of the gas stations that sell it here in Iowa, Illinois, Minnesota, Wisconsin, Pennsylvania are required to stop selling in the summer. But with this waiver, on June 1, you're not going to show up at your local gas station and see a bag over the pump that has the cheapest gas. You're going to be able to keep filling up with E15. We're also working to address food prices. Because right now, farmers aren't getting a fair deal and nationwide and neither are families at the grocery store. So we're investing up to $1 billion in the American Rescue Funds for new and expanded meat and poultry processing capacity throughout this country.